If you need to create a math equation and have at least version 1.6 of Active Inspire, it's easy to make math equations. Go to Insert on the menu bar, click Equation, and then click on your page to open the Equation Editor. Let's say we want to create an equation to find the volume of a sphere. So we can type V, and then if we go to this first button, we can select the equal sign. And now we need 4 thirds pi r cubed for our formula. So if we click on the second button and select the fraction tool, we'll be able to type in 4 thirds. We could type 4 and then use the tab key, or you can use your mouse and cursor to move to the bottom box but I can tab to the next box and type the number 3 and now again I can use the tab key to get out of the fraction tool or I can use my mouse and cursor and I need the pi symbol so let's go over to the alpha gamma function button and select the pi symbol and now we need the radius cubed so if we come back to the second button, we can select the exponent tool and we can type R and then use our tab button or again our mouse and cursor to move to the exponent box and type the 3 for cubed and again our tab button to get out of the exponent and there's our formula. If we click on the OK button, it will insert the formula right into our flip chart and at this point I still have the equation editor tool active so if I click on the page anywhere it's going to open the equation editor again so what I need to do like any other tool that I use in the flip chart is go over and click the select tool to turn off that equation editor tool now I can grab a hold of that equation I can move it around I can make it larger or smaller and reposition it on the page if I notice something's wrong with the equation, I can just double click on the equation to reopen it in the equation editor and I could correct whatever's wrong with the equation. But if it's correct, I can just click the OK button.